about all my lipsticks. Um, these are just some lipsticks I've been collecting over the past month and not month, few months. <laughs> I didn't buy this much in one month. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go through some of them, show you how some of them look on my lips and do some swatches and let's get started. Okay, so one of the first ones I'm going to talk about is this Collection 2000 lipstick. It's in the shade 1 and it's the Gothic Glam collection and it's in, it's called Seduction and it's this kind of um, whiny red I guess um, I got this like uh, last week so I've only used it twice or three times but I really like it actually um, it's really nice and um, I, don't, I don't really love any like bright red lipstick so I'm kind of into darker ones and yeah I really like this colour I'm going to swatch it on my hand this is what it looks like um, yeah I really like it I think it's really nice and um, there's other there's another one I want to get in this gothic glam line but I have to check it out um, I think it's like a purplish colour I can't wait to get that one so next next up <sighs> the next one is um, an MUA lipstick. Now these lipsticks are only one pound, which I think is amazing. Um, so they're really good for like people who are not sure about the color. Like it's your maybe your first time buying a certain color, and you just want to see how it looks on your lips. It's really good because it's just one pound. So um, I I really like it. It's this one it's in shade one and it's again a dark deep red I love this color so much because it's so like elegant so this is how the MUA in shade one lipstick looks on my lips as it is one of my favorites I decided to show you guys how it looks like I love it and it is quite dark but I still think it's brilliant. Okay, so next up is this lipstick um, by NARS and it's in the shade Amsterdam. It's a brownish colour lipstick and I really like it. I think it's really like unique. I haven't seen this colour anywhere else. Um, and I saw it on the lady who was um, in the NARS counter and I really liked it and I asked her which one it was and she showed me and I didn't love so I had to get it. Um, I think it was like £19 and I really really like it so um, yeah. Next up is this, this is the only kind of nudie colour I have, I don't really like nudes. Um, it's by Rimmel London and it's in the shade um, 066 and it's this nudie colour. Um, I don't, I use it sometimes but um, the reason I don't really like it is because it does have kind of like shimmers in it. I don't really like that. I prefer matte ones. But I still really like this one just for nudes because I don't have any. <laughs> that one's the only one I actually can use. Uh, next up is another MUA lipstick. I think MUA are so good with the lipsticks and they're so cheap. And this one is like a purplish colour. Um, it's in the shade 2. And it's this purpley colour. I like it because I just feel like it, it goes on the lips so easily and it's really easy to apply and um, I think the purpley colour is really nice for like summer, spring, winter, everything. I think this is a nice lipstick for everything and I use it a lot. Um, now these two aren't really lipsticks but they are kind of something for the lips. They're the um, Apocalypse... Um, Rimmel London, Rimmel, Rimmel London uh, liquid lacquers and this one is in the shade apocalyptic and I'm just going to put a bit because they are quite strong <laughs> and this one is in the shade Luna and it, this one's my favourite actually they're both really different but this one is the pinky one and this one is the orangey one which I think is perfect um, I love the orangey one actually. Those are the two I have from that um, range. And this one, oh, this one is another one of my favourites. 
I love this lipstick so much. It's Rimmel London and it's in the shade 107 and it's the darky winey um, red. Um, it is one of my favourite ones and I think it's so nice. Here we go. I love that colour a lot and um, I think it's one of my favourite wines because it's matte and that is just perfect. I love it because it doesn't go on your lips or on your teeth. Not on lips, on your teeth. Um, okay, next up is this one. I don't really use it. I got it because so many people were talking about it. It's in the shade, it's Rimmel London again, Kate Moss, in the shade 03 and it's a nude. And it looks really horrible because half of it is stuck in here. Silly me. Um, but yeah, it's basically a nude and I don't really like, I don't even use it but there's no use in giving it to someone because it's horrible inside. But I guess I will try and use it one day, it's just not my colour. Um, next up is Barry M and this is in 145, um, it doesn't have a name. And I like Barry M lipsticks but I don't, I don't, I've only tried this one and it's like a hot pink. This is the reason why I don't love it that much because the pigmentation isn't that good. Um, but I still think it's an okay lipstick. Um, I would definitely want to try more Barry M lipsticks, but this one for now is quite good. Um, and it's one of my only kind of bright lipsticks apart from my Flat Out Fabulous. So, yeah, guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you have enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And um, I will hopefully see you guys next week for another video. So yeah, take care guys. Bye.